Welcome back to the Arizona Daily Mix. I don't know who wrote this, please, but this is how it goes. My pie can be your pie with their new take and bake kits. Check this out. Ryan, um, I've been wanting to make pizza at home, especially in my pie pizza. You guys do such a good job. Now I can't, right? Absolutely, exactly. My pie take and bake. So let's talk about this. How does this work? Do I just come in, grab it and go, you or got, you give me you instructions? So we set you up with uh, you know, dough, sauce, cheese, and your favorite toppings. Um, we've got a couple different dough options. We have um, gluten for your cauliflower. We also do our house-made white dough. Um, so if I want to walk you through it here, we give you a little bit of flour. Give yourself a little bit of uh, a little flour here so you can work with and basically coat your dough. All right. Then what you want to do here, if you're using white dough, is treat it like a steering wheel. So you're going to lift, you're going to lift it up and you're going to slowly just turn it one side, stretching it out nice and thin, but not too thin. So there's no holes. So I'm going to stretch out my dough, just turning it like a steering wheel. I'm going to bring it back down here. And I'm just going to give it a little bit more of a stretch here to make it more of a circle. And as big as I want it, we make 11 inch pies. So these doughs are made to be 11 inches. Oh, wow. Yeah. If so I then when you have your dough thin crust, there. If I want thin crust, can I go bigger? Yeah, you can go bigger. I wouldn't go bigger than 12 inches, though, because it's made for a, a 11 inch thin crust. So 12 inches would be ultra thin. So just okay. be careful on that. And you don't want to tear the dough. Yeah. So 12 All inches. All right. Once you have that. You want to take a cookie sheet or a baking sheet and just a light olive oil, oil mist or a Crisco or just even a little olive oil to coat your pan. Then I'm going to transfer my dough right to my, my pan. And now the fun begins, right? Yeah. So now it's pizza your way, okay? So let's start with the sauce. The kit comes with your favorite sauce. We, uh, we always recommend our signature pizza sauce. All right? So put your sauce right in the middle of the dough. And then concentric circles, inside out, inside out. All right, nice even spread. Not too much, not too light. If you like a little bit more sauce, go ahead and make it your way. Leave about a half inch of crust here so you have a nice raising, rising crust in the oven, okay? Next, you want to season your sauce. You're going to take your Parmesan Romano blend, and you're just going to season that sauce a little bit. Adds what? a little bit of nice um, salt flavor to the uh, sweet pizza sauce. What do you put Finally, in Finally, I like Ryan, shredded Ryan, much. I like are, traditional. Wait, slow down, Ryan. What'd you put on there? What'd a Parmesan put? Romano blend. So it's a, uh, a premium grated cheese. It just seasons the sauce real nice. You okay. can put that in the pizza and use it as a garnish after your pizza's cooked. All right? Finally, okay. traditional shredded mozzarella. Outside in. Outside in. So I'm going to take my cheese outside in and you want to see you don't want to do too much cheese because you want balance so you want to see a little bit of red underneath white a little bit of red underneath white just the right amount because that'll blend together when it melts together come out really nice and balanced so that's our sauce and cheese um on our crust starter right that okay finally choose your favorite toppings you know we have um you know plenty of um, assorted meats and fresh veggies we bring in fresh produce so i like a little combo of both I like starting with some pepperoni, traditional roni here. I'm going to do a little bit of sausage. That looks All so right. Good. I, I'm, I can't mm. wait to do my kit. I'm, Ryan, I got my kit here. I've been eating some of the pasta and stuff too, a little bit out of the, the salad <laughs> or something like that, which is so good. How can people get these kits? You got it. So we have, uh, we're offering it at two locations. Our, uh, Phoenix location on Tatum and Cactus, you can call in. Uh, we're also offering it at our Tempe location, you can call as well. It's also on our online ordering app and uh, third party delivery. So, and I see you got salads. So call, just let them know what you like. And salads, right? Yep, we're doing, uh, it's a, we do a family kit with two pies, two big salads. We do a date night. Um, now we can offer um, alcohol to go, comes with a bottle of wine. Um, and we're also doing some home goods. We're offering uh, some flour kits. If you want to just bake at home, um, we do bottled wine and truly to go as well. So we're, we're having a lot of fun uh, in this new uh, new way of doing business. We're figuring it out. I like it. All right. I got dinner plans all set for tonight. So, Ryan, thank all right. you very much. All right. You got it. And then uh, in the oven, 475, 12 to 15 minutes. You decide how crispy you like it, 12 to 15 minutes. That's it. Perfect. I love it. Ryan, That's it. 
I can't wait. I'm going to have my pie tonight, and I'll let you know how it looks, okay? You got it. Enjoy, please. All right. Bye, you later.